Hey guys, this is Red, welcome back to a new Minecraft video where today I'm not alone, I'm here with Simap, as you can see. Hey guys, it's really nice to be back on YouTube, so... Yes, exactly. The first time I'm recording a video in like five months, and I'm here with my mate. And it's a, really, it's a really special collab. Today we are going to play a mini game that I have thought of. Um, that both includes Minecraft and languages, different languages. There are 10 different levels in this game. Uh, I have chosen 10 different words that are in 10 different languages, which you can see here from the flags. Basically, he, he will have to guess the words that I have decided to put behind this uh, banner here. And of course, there are a couple of rules which we are going to read together. So, there are a total of 10 levels and you can get 9 plus 1 points per level. I will get to that one extra point later. And of course, there are 100 total points. I, actually, it's really difficult to get 100 points because it's almost impossible to guess all of the words at the first try. So there are three hints per level. And each time you consume one of these hints, you will lose uh, points. So for the first hint, you lose one point. For the second hint, two points. And for the third hint, you lose three points out of those nine total points. If you give a wrong answer also, you will lose one point each time. And basically, if you use all of the three hints and you gave three wrong answers, you will lose the level. So yeah, it's good to not give um, wrong answers. Sign up. <laughs> and also, <laughs> if you give a correct answer at the first try, you will get an extra point, which is that one that I was talking about. So even if you use the hints, but you give a, a correct answer at the first time, you will get an extra point. All right, so you guys can play together with us. And basically, I will not leave the correct answer on the screen but I will leave them in the description of the video. So if you don't want to wait until we reveal what word was, you can go in the description of the video and check it as we play the game. If you want to play together with us, just try and guess the words and maybe write it in the comment section down below. Also, there will be another video on Simap's channel where he decides 10 different words and we have to guess them. So make sure to check it. Links in the descriptions and in the card appearing on the screen. Right? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. We're, we're done with the explanation, okay. finally. <laughs> so, first five languages are um, five Romance languages, because, of course, uh, we speak Italian, so I said, uh, let's choose something that is not too difficult. And actually, they are difficult. Oops, we... Uh, calm down, mate. Yeah, we, we got to the you, French one. You, yeah, we accidentally went on the pressure plate. I, I was hoping to, to start from the French one. Um, uh, we're gonna it'll be the next one. All right, so Spanish. let's begin with word number one, which is from Spanish, and it's Zanahoria. Pro Zanahoria. Yeah, probably my pronunciation is not correct. I have absolutely no idea of what it could be. All right, so of course you can use um, uh, yeah, hint number I'm one. Gonna, I'm totally going to use the, the first hint. You can break the banner. I, I can break. I can decide the, whichever one I want. No, no, no. Only the one on the left, and then we ah, go okay. on the right. This one it's not here. a block. <laughs> oh. Okay. Okay. Uh, so <laughs> I'm looking at the creative inventory and I see there are a lot of items. Yes. So probably so... you will have to still use a a hint. It's not a problem if you use all of three of them. I mean, it's really Zanahoria. difficult. Um, when I think of the word, I'm thinking like um, some equipment like armor or tools or Actually, maybe a bow. Yeah. Wait, I have written them on a paper because I forgot them. I made this uh, whole thing yesterday. Um, okay, what do you think it is? Uh, no, no, I think I'm going to, to use the, the hint. Okay, use second it's hint. It's not convenient to me to guess it right and away. And you lose other two points out of In the... English, it begins with C. Okay. C. It's an item, so basically it's an item that begins with the letter C. C. So it's not a bow. As I thought, it could be some cooked food. You are partly mm. right. So this oh. is a hint that I gave you. <laughs> huh. It's a free hint, okay? You don't lose points for that. Actually, guys, I have a paper here. You can hear it from the microphone, hopefully. And uh, basically, I've written all of the different levels uh -huh. and I'm like putting on the paper all of the hints that he's using. So at the end, I can calculate the total points that he gets. I'm ex excluding uh, fish. I don't think it's fish. Okay. Uh, maybe uh, mutton. I don't know. I don't know. You can decide to give the correct answer or uh, you can mm -hmm. use another hint, which probably will help you a lot. Wait, let me read it. Or actually, no, I, just, I will just copy the sign and put it here. Uh, okay. If you want, you can use the other hint and it will help you a lot. I don't know. 
It's up to you. Yes, I'm gonna use the. Okay, let me it's put orange. it on the table. So it's orange. Now you probably it's know what food. it is. It's a cooked food. It's cooked cooked salmon. Um, no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. I didn't no. say it's cooked. So it's an item. It begins with C, and it's orange. Uh, also, it begins with C, not with S. So you should get the correct one now. Go in the food Whoa. tab. Crops. It's oh. orange. And it's not a block. It's a cookie. No, no, no. It's a, a cookie. It's not orange. Ah. <laughs> In the, in the textures, it kind of looks like... Uh, no, no, it has it's... to be orange, like orange. I think I'm gonna Come get, on, it's, it, like, zero points. It's it's really easy. You can, if you want, you can give me an answer and I'll tell you if it's wrong or not. <laughs> so, you know Wait, that... Doesn't, doesn't have any, anything come to my mind? So, it's like... something edible. It begins with C and it's orange. What could it be? What kind of food is orange? Go on the food tab. <laughs> it's so easy, actually, because I I know it. But I I I think that I'll do the same when you will choose some words for me. A potato doesn't doesn't start start with C. Just look at the uh, colors. Oh, it's a carrot. <laughs> yeah, all <Yes>. right. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so yeah, uh, carrot is the correct answer. Did I get answer. zero points? No, one? actually, at the first try, you you did it right, but I I gave you like too many helps. Anyways. Counted as like the first level, it's something where I help you. So uh, you get here three points. Oh, all right. Oh. Let's continue with the next one. Actually, this video is going to be long, <laughs> longer than I expected. Yeah, or I maybe not, so. because we are on the French side and Simap did French in school. I did. Yeah, I studied French uh, in middle school, so maybe, maybe. All right. I did Spanish in middle school, so something. I'm pretty good with Spanish. All right. So, oh, yeah. He, okay. So French. Entonnoir. Entonnoir. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I think that yeah, I have chosen something that you did you don't know. No, no. So I, of I, course, I, of course, you can use the hints. Yeah. Okay. Let's let's use the first hint. It's a block. Uh, okay. Entonnoir. It's not a really helpful hint, but it's you know it eliminates a lot of wrong blocks. So, so it, it it ends with noir, which means uh, black. Uh, I I don't know if, uh, if don't it's get like fooled a by the word. by the by the name. Don't get fooled by it. I suggest you to use like other hints. It doesn't yeah, matter if you don't make the most the of points. One. It's a technic redstone block. Uh, okay. Uh, redstone. And of let's course, guys, see. if you are playing with us or if you don't want to play with us, all the words will be in the description of the video. So yeah, you can go and check them and see what we are talking about and maybe laugh at us. Also, French people are probably laughing at us. <laughs> <laughs> and also, yeah. at, like my pronunciation or <laughs> yeah. And I have anything. decided to I have decided to make this kind of uh, new format for the videos because I said like I have a lot of people watching me from other countries and also people like watching from English speaking countries. Uh, I said they will enjoy it because you know it's more knowledge. Uh, you can decide to use the third for the. Hint, okay, uh, so I'm, I'm just uh, giving myself all the items that it could be like all wrestling related stuff. Mm -hmm. So I've got a bunch of them. Yeah. So here they are. So it's it's a block. So it's not a, a comparator. It's not a. Re th those are those considered blocks? Yes. Okay, so it's a block. It's a technique wrestling block. Um, yes. So it it could be anything really. <laughs> Entonnoir. I'm gonna I'm gonna use the, yeah. the thirty in. Okay. It's gray. Yeah, this one so should it's, help. It's not a, a repeater. It's not redstone block of redstone, redstone torch. Uh, not a button, or maybe a stone button. It could be a stone button, a lever, maybe a hopper. It's not gray, yeah. day, let's say. So you can try and uh, um, like and get it. try your luck yeah. and see, like, and try not to lose any other points. So we've got these three items. Uh, wish me luck. I'm gonna choose uh, the first one. So the you hopper. say it's Hopper and it's correct. It's correct. <laughs> Good I job. I cannot believe it. You get other three points on this level because you use uh, three. Oh no, actually wait, it's four points because you got it right at first. Yeah, it's uh, plus one. Oh, also I've on the, the uh, also on time. level uh, also on level one, it's four. Yeah, I have no, forgot about You the... helped me a lot. Okay, not, so I'll make it was three. was not the first guess. Okay, yeah, of course. Okay, three. 
So yeah, you get full points. Good job. In French, it's Antonio. Oh, now oh, we are on Italian. So now it's Italian. For uh, for those of you new guys who are subscribed to our channels, um, you should know that we both speak Italian as our mother tongues. And um, I said, like, I found the word. I said uh, I didn't know if I wanted to include Italian, but I found the word that I I as well didn't know. So I don't know if Simap doesn't know it or not. But yeah, just break the no no not the hints <laughs> here. <laughs> break the banner. So Italian Tritolo. Tritolo. Yes, I, I know what it means. So Damn. sorry about that, but it's <laughs> a block. It's orange. It's um, it's TNT. Yes, <laughs> good job. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know it yeah. when I was looking for it. you. I, I would be a little bit uh, like preoccupied if I didn't know it. Like, <laughs> okay, so you get ten points here. Um, let's go to this. The... Was quick. Yeah, this, this was, was quick. quick. <laughs> to level number four, and we got Romanian. I actually Romanian. speak Romanian because a lot of you guys have asked me if I speak Romanian. Yes, it's also my second mother tongue because my parents are I Romanian. Don't, I don't speak Romanian. I don't know anything about so, Romanian. So, Romanian is a language that comes from Latin, but the word that I've chosen here comes from Slavic because Romanian has also Slavic words. And I said, no. since you speak Italian, no. which is a Latin uh, Latin based language, I said, let's make it difficult for you. Uh, look in the other in the other 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 side. Okay, here. Um, all right. So the pronunciation is uh, undice. Undice. <laughs> undice. You can start it's using those hard. hints. Let's let's use the first. It's an item. Okay, mm. so it's an item. It doesn't help you really much, but well, no. I'm gonna use the second one. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> It's a tool. So it's, it's a, a tool. tool. So I'm actually writing on the paper like what hints he's using so I can calculate all the points at the end. So yeah, it's 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 an item and it's a tool. By mm. tool I don't mean just pickaxe swords, but it can be like a tool can be a also a shear. It can be okay, other stuff. Okay. okay, stuff that you use to do something. I could have chosen like a word that came from Latin, but I said I want to be yeah, it it, it, it was gonna be uh, too easy. So yes, you 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 challenged me. Uh, yeah, you, you did well. And you know what? I'm afraid that you will do the same with me. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> if you want, you can use the third one. Yeah. Um. No, maybe it's not convenient to use the third one. I don't know. You can try to guess from like all the different tools. And actually, all the tools are items, if you think. So the first one didn't really help you that much. All right, so Simap has finally so put I've all of these items. So I've got a bunch of items mm -hmm. in my inventory. Undita. Uh, Undita. It's a hoe. Undita. Uh, so is it your final answer? Yes. And I want to try. It's not a hoe, so you lose one no. uh, potential <laughs> I'm really point. Sad. You can throw it. <laughs> Or you could decide to use the other, the last uh, hint, which, let me see if it actually helps a lot or not. Wait. Oh yeah, it helps you a lot. So okay, you can decide to give a... the last one. All right. It's so. made with strings. Oh, it's um, it's a fishing rod. And... Right? It's correct. Yeah. It's a fishing rod. Unditze. So you get How two points. How many points? Two points. Two points. Yes. You could have gotten so, like four I think points. It's impossible to get one hundred. Yeah, uh, as I said, as I said at the beginning, you speak like ten different yes, languages. Yes, unless you are like a super level. polyglot, you it's like impossible. So level number five with Portuguese trigo. Trigo. <laughs> it, it looks like something with three tails or three something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. Um, I'm gonna use the hint. Okay, let me put it it's on the yellow. paper. Mm. So it's yellow. It's yellow. Yeah. It could be a clock, it could be gold, it could be a hay bale, it could be... I don't know, it could be a lot of things. Actually, hint number two will help you a lot. You probably will get it right if you use hint number two. It could be glowstone, it could be blaze rods, it could be... It could be a lot of things. It could be dice, but I don't think it's that simple. Uh, yes, I'm gonna use the second hint. Okay. Uh, it can be an item, but also a block. But let me explain it. The item will be different than the block. It's not like glowstone. Um, like, no, actually glowstone can be one of them. Uh, I was thinking yeah. about that. It's not like, like a lime terracotta, okay? I have it as a mm -hmm. item, but it's the same as the block. 
So it's something that is different as an item and is different as a block. I'm thinking of an hay bale, uh, because it's an item in a for in the form of wheat, mm -hmm. and it can be a block when you stack it up and you use it as a All right. hay bale. Trigo, yes. So I'm, I'm, is it your? I'm gonna final say answer? it's an hay bale. And it's correct. Wheat. Yeah, it, and wheat actually, yes, it's seven points. No, no, actually. Yeah, yeah, it's seven points. Good job. Oh, that's good. Good job on the Portuguese one. So let's continue with level number six. We've got here a really special language. Break it. No, no, the, uh, the other side. We have Esperanto. here Esperanto. So Esperanto is a word that is not official in any other country. Is a language, actually not a word, a language. Is a language that um, someone tried to implement as a European universal language. But it didn't go as planned. Incendia pulvoro. Okay. Uh, it it kind of sounds like Latin. <laughs> yes. And <laughs> but... uh, in Italian is exactly the same thing. So this is kind of easy for you. Oh, I got this. I got this. Uh, incendia, like... Um, it has to be something with fire. There's uh, a word incendio in Italiano. Yes. Oh, I was <laughs> there, there's like a word uh, incendio, which means like fire. Yes. And uh, pulvoro... There's uh, polvere, which yes. means dust. All right. So like, uh, it's gonna be obviously, obviously, uh, blaze drum roll and yes, it's blaze powder. You get ten points for this one. In this world, knowing Italian helped me a lot. So yeah, exactly. Let's continue with the, the the next one. And we go to German level German. number seven. Break the this one, this banner here. And, all right, so German... No, no, no. are you <laughs> kidding me? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> so... I, I, I won't try to pronounce it. So even my you pronunciation... Will. I am, like, studying German on... I have an app on my phone and I'm studying German a bit. Um, so, But my pronunciation will be probably wrong. So sorry, German people who are watching this video. Verwell Trunk, uh, der Unterwasser, mm, Unterwasseratmung, something like this. I suggest you to look at the last word, Antwasseratmung. Okay, so... Um, because it's similar to English, a part of it. It's like a composite word. Yes, uh, I know this is how Wasser German is made. Wasser means like water. Okay. Uh, okay. Unter, it would mean like under. All under right. water. Uh, Radmung, it could be uh, easier than you think. It could be easier okay, than so you think. Okay, so something under, underwater. Can I can I guess some mobs or aren't there any? Uh, actually, I didn't include any mobs. Okay, so you can use your hints or uh, try to. Try I will your try luck. to to not use any. Okay. This time. But remember that if you give a wrong answer, I will subtract one point, and also you will not get the extra point for giving the correct answer at first. So technically, you lose two points if you give the wrong answer. Mm. And you lose only one if you use one hint, but let me see if it's one of those hints that tells you if it's... Uh, okay, the first hint is not really helpful. No, actually it's helpful. Actually it's helpful, even if it doesn't look like. Mang it kind, kind of reminds me of mud, even though I, I don't think it's going to be like a, a valid thing. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking about Prismarine, uh, something underwater. Alright, or... so I suggest you to use um, hint number one. Okay, it's not Prismarine. Let's use the hint. It's not a block. Okay, yeah. <laughs> so it's not Prismarine. So it's something that has to do with water. Maybe if you write in the search bar something about water. Water. Yes, you will get... Actually, you will get a big help if you write water in the... Let's try it. Uh, water. Oh, so I get a bucket of water and some splash bottles. Mm. So look at the name. It's really long. I'm 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 thinking about the um, verbal trunk the there bucket, on the bus. Just okay. because you you told me to search water in the search bar. What you what water bucket? Yeah. I don't know. Is let's, it your final let, answer? Let's try it. Is it your final I'm gonna answer? I'm gonna try it. And it's not water bucket. No. It's not water bucket. Maybe you could try to use wait. Let me see what hint number two does. Okay. No, actually, hint number two is not that helpful. Okay, I'm not going to use it. I'm gonna try uh, something that, that involves water. Mm, what it could be. Could be ice, but mm, it's like not a the block, part underwater. Said, it's not, not a block. It's not a block, as hint ah, number yeah, one Yeah, it's said. not a block. Verbal trunk der Antwasser Mung. 
Anter Vassaram Tmung. Okay, something like this. My pronunciation will be probably really bad. Also, guys, I take this time as Simon is thinking to advertise my second channel. If you like these kind of videos where uh, I involve different languages, on my second channel, which is my vlogging channel, which I will link in the description of this video as well, I make similar videos where I have to guess like the accent of uh, people or where I have to guess different words from other languages and I have made a video with my cousin like a collab so if you want guys I will link everything in the description of the video and it's a lot of fun that as well uh, so I got an arrow of water breathing uh, a water bottle as some splash uh, remember under water underwater remember that underwater hmm what you do underwater what helps you do something under the water oh it's like water breathing I can yeah, say I mean, anything. Yeah, it, it's probably that. But there is the the potion. There's the splash potion. It, exactly. So you thing. could you could actually it's it's better for you not to use the hints and try your luck. Yeah, I'm 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 gonna try and guess. It's uh, a potion of water breathing. And it's not a potion of water breathing. Therefore, no. <laughs> therefore is. Therefore it's. So you could choose between splash potion. And lingering potion. Uh huh. It's so one of those. It's a lingering potion. It's a splash potion. I don't know. <laughs> Let's one. try with the lingering 50 -50. one. And it's. It doesn't fit. Lingering it also. Po yeah, I yeah. Can't even see the, <laughs> yeah, the it's, whole, it was a whole. typo. Lingering potion of water breathing. So, uh, how many wrong answers did you give me? Two. Uh, a yes. lot. <laughs> so one, two, three, four, five, six points you get on this. Actually, you get f six points even if you gave wrong answers. What? Because yes, because you didn't he use the hints. All right, so let's oh. continue with the next language, which is Vietnamese. Pitong. Pitong. It's not that difficult. It's not as difficult as you might think. Once uh, that you know what language. From my is. English, uh, pit means like. I don't think it's gonna be. I can understand it by like. I don't know the pronunciation. Um, yeah, of course, our pronunciation is screwed in this video. <laughs> sorry, Vietnamese people. Sorry, people who uh, speak the following languages. Uh, yeah. Yeah, probably all of them, except for <laughs> Italian, maybe. Yeah, and Romanian. And Romanian, yes, for you. Uh, 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 Pitong. I'm going to use the, the first hint. Okay. For sure, it's so, a block. It's a block. <laughs> Doesn't help that it's much, but... Hmm. If you use the second, I don't know why, hint, but it gives me uh, the sensation of being uh, like uh, some dirt, some, or mycelium could be. Mm -hmm. I or don't know. The soul sand block, or you something could, like that. You could use second hint, and it will tell you a lot about it. Like, yeah, let's try it. There are two variants of it, and only uh, two variants of it. Not. I'm more thinking about so. dirt and coarse dirt. Even though I could think of a third variant, which is the grass block. Which, uh, as I said, uh, in hint number two, it has to be only two variants. So? So it's not this one. Exactly. Also, let me show to the people watching uh, hint number three. You guys can get it... the hints even if we don't. So these are the other two hints. You can watch them. And try to guess them. Or if you can't guess, of course, everything will be in the description of this video. So you guys can laugh at us, not knowing, actually at Simup. You will laugh at me in Simup's video. Yeah, yeah. Come to my channel and, and watch the Red Engineer. <laughs> yeah, Lose. Exactly. Lose. Maybe, <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> but we'll oh, who see. Who knows? We'll who see. knows? I love learning about new languages and like I, I know a lot of words of other languages. But probably they will not be in the levels. So, mm. I don't know. I'm thinking about cobblestone, but... I'm not really sure. Okay, so if you're not really sure, hint number three will definitely help you, but of course it will cost you three different points. Let's try it. So, yeah. Uh, it's a Technic block. So, there oh. are two variants of it. It's a Technic block, and it's a block, as hint number one said. Let's go to the redstone tab. Actually, I'm, I'm really confused by the pocket edition tabs. Yeah, exactly. We don't <laughs> I have I find it really tab. difficult to navigate and find the items. I prefer the one on the the Java version. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They should implement it. There are two variants of it. So you it could, could still be get four. You could still use f um, like get four points if you give the correct answer at first. Or it didn't... could be a button because there is the wooden and the stone one. Or it could be a pressure plate. 
Now but look, look. More can I can I say something? Look at the name, Pit Tong. Pit Tong. <laughs> Doesn't tell me anything. Yeah. Uh, After you will find out what block it is, it will look a lot similar to the name of that block in English. Tong. Okay, I probably said too much. No, Make a list no, of the items that you think are, and we'll come back to you guys. I will cut this part. And we'll be back when our sign up has a full list of the items. Okay, so after uh, discussing like some similar sounds to English, mm -hmm. piston, piston, and so, so it has two variants. It's a block, so I I think I'm 100% sure it's piston. Okay, is it the final answer? Press the button. Yes. Actually, uh, if I tell you to press, the, uh, it's behind here. And it's yeah. a piston, right? So you said it's right at the first try, and you get four points for this level. We got two levels left, so let's continue and let's go. We got Greek, Greek. and then uh, actually this one. is not a Finnish. Uh, it's not the Finnish uh, banner, if the Finnish flag. I have used the old version of the Greek uh, flag because, like, the new one was was impossible to make with banners. So let's break the banner, Greek, and I have written uh, I like. I will read it. <laughs> uh, you can read it in uh, Latin words. Is the same pronunciation. Petra Mevria. Petra Mevria. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Um, Petra uh, sounds like Pietra, which in Italian is uh, All right. stone. All right. Me, uh, I, I, I don't, I don't think I can translate it. Mm -hmm. And Ria. Petra Mevria. Mm. Let me copy the hints so people watching can see the so. hints. What kind of stone? These are uh, the hints for you guys. Maybe a stone brick. Petra Mevria. Mm, or cobblestone. So uh, you... Actually, hint number one is one of those that doesn't help that much. Because already you, you already know that is A. Is it an item or a block? It's a block. All right. So hint number one. <laughs> you know what it is. What it tells. Anyways, you can decide to use all of the three hints or try your luck. Even though there are many stone blocks. So... Uh, I'm not going to use the hints because I noticed that um, it's more convenient to just guess the, okay. the, the blocks yeah, because instead you, of using exactly, the hints. Exactly, you have like you, you nine more tries. points that way. Uh, so, uh, something with stone. There's, there's a lot of things. There's cobblestone walls, there's stone bricks, there's uh, stone slabs, there's... Yeah, plenty of stuff. And it's it has to be a block, right? As you guessed. It from, has to be a block, uh, from yeah. the world. So, let's exclude stone, pickaxe, etc, etc. All of that stuff. As you can see, it has two words. Try to think something that, like, it's not a single word, okay? If you I use the hints, you will probably... Wait, if you use the hints, you would probably lose less points. If you use... Uh, f hint number one and hint hint number two. You say hint number two is going to be yeah, but to uh, unlock it, you, you need me an yeah. answer. Yeah, it will help you a lot, but of course to unlock hint number two, you will have to use hint number one, which okay, let's use them both. Okay. Uh, so this one says it's partly green. It's partly oh. green. So it's gonna be Mason, maybe Petra Mevria. Mm. Okay. Vria. Oh, it kind of reminds me of green. Verde. Mm -hmm. Vria. So I think it's going to be most. Or maybe they, they could be most stone bricks. Uh, but let, you... let's, let's try with most stone. Okay, so is it the final answer? Yes. And it's most it's stone. It's correct. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six points. Oh, no, actually seven points because you got it right at first. So good oh. job, good job. Actually, I, I didn't expe expect you like to make so many points. I will probably make like doers. And <laughs> as the last language we'll see, we'll see. we have here, Filipino, and we have Palacong Brillante. Brillante sounds like Spanish. I don't know why. <laughs> yes, and also I also like Italian Brillante. Yeah, which means like. Which means. Uh... Say it, say it to the people. Oh yeah, it, it has some more meanings, but yeah, so. And brillante, which means shiny. So, Palakong. Uh... <laughs> let me see. Let me show to the people the different hints that we have in this level. It could be uh, something. Uh, if you think of something shiny, you think of diamonds, of emerald, of uh, some precious stones or ores. Mm -hmm. So, and Palakong. Palakong. <laughs> 
Yeah, if you use what... hint number two, it will probably help you eliminate mm. a lot of wrong blocks. Items, so before blocks, I used uh, two hints and I got seven points, which isn't bad. So I'm gonna use them again. So it's an item. Oh, right. it's an item. Okay, so it's not going to be the block version of it. Okay. And, and it's, it's, a, it's tool. a tool. So, yeah, you should get it now. And actually, no. Brillante. No, because there are many tools that are made out of Brillante. Which is probably Diamond at this point. And Palakong. Palakong. I think it's a shovel. Because in Italian, it Pala is shovel. Yeah, yeah. In Italian, uh, shovel is pala. Pala con brillante. You can... Uh, is it the final answer you give or...? Yeah, it's diamond shovel. And it's not diamond shovel. No. <laughs> it's not diamond shovel. I'm really disappointed. That's why I have one. chosen pala con, because I said, since it it's pala like looks like Italian... Friend. Exactly, I did it on purpose. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, it could be a pickaxe also, maybe. Uh, I don't think it's an axe. It doesn't doesn't really sound like an axe. A sword either, so... Mm -mm. Yeah, I'm gonna try with the pickaxe. And it's not pickaxe. <laughs> no, seriously. <laughs> I look so <laughs> evil right now. Um, how many points do I, do I lose if I use um, the third one? Uh, basically, if you get it right after using the third one, uh, you get only one point, but... Uh, from what I can see, you already guessed. Actually, the third one will not help you that much from the information you already have. So let, let's not use it. Uh, Palakong. Maybe it's a hoe. It's I don't know. Not Tell a me. shovel. It's a hoe. Tell me if it's your uh, final answer. Yes, let's try. It's worth it. And uh, it's not a hoe. hoe. It's not no. a diamond hoe. No. <laughs> so you could get only three points if you get it right now. So, or you can try to guess it three times. What other um, tools you have? Not I've many. Le I have left. Um, I, I think you have two, two, two tools left. The sword and the, the axe. Okay. So, it's, it so I have a 50-50 of... yeah, chance, of, chance. Guess, of guessing it. So I'm gonna palakong. Palakong. <laughs> maybe, maybe it's a sword, even though I, I would choose the axe. Maybe it's a sword, <laughs> it's like the opposite thing I would... Oh god, I it's so think. nice to already know the answer and see like others struggle ah. to find it. <laughs> I'm gonna go for the sword. Uh, and it's not, not sword. Uh, so it's the axe. <laughs> exactly. So here you get... I wasn't lucky, I wasn't lucky this time at all. Okay, yeah, so no. it's diamond axe. And you get two points. So let me calculate the total of points that you got. 55 points out of 10. Uh, uh, out of 100, not out of 10. And it's actually it's actually a really good number. Because if you think uh, making 100 points is basically impossible, it's technically impossible. Yeah, yeah. Even getting 90 points is a lot. So 55 is like... It's a really good, um, it's a really good score. So well done to sign up and thanks for coming on my channel and accepting the it Minecraft language really, challenge. Really also, guys, before closing, remember that uh, there's a video on Simon's channel where he decides ten different words in ten different languages that he wants, and I will have to guess them. So this time you can have fun seeing me struggling to find the correct answer. <laughs> I will so, be evil and I will choose the worst word exactly I could. so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did so don't forget to drop a like under it and also let me know if you want to see me do this um, new content this new format with other people maybe other redstoners other youtubers uh, i don't know let me know in the comment section down below and also make like a vote of what languages you want to uh, see included in this video here uh, because a lot of you guys are watching me from other countries so hope you guys enjoyed it thanks for watching until the end and i'll see you all guys in the next video see or actually on simup's channel subscribe to him as well see you bye bye